not a good. I don't feel that good. You know, came here just trying to turn the season around and get better. And uh, you know, this is it's not good. Calvin, you, you kind of emerged as one of the leaders in this locker room. What do you say to those guys? How do you get them to you know, continue to press forward? Um, we just gotta keep our locker room to you know. We just gotta stay here with it. You know, play for each other, talk to each other. You know, we just gotta stay right here, you know, with each other, and that's it. What was it like coming back in here after this? Uh, I mean, before we came in, I mean, we was losing bad, man. You know, it's, you know, it's not good. What was going right early for you and Mason? How much of things around you complicate? No, me personally, just the way the season going, I gotta, you know, I'm gonna do whatever I gotta do to play better personally. You know, man, I'm not. I love football. I don't just come to do this for money or anything. I do it because I love it and I wanna play for my brothers. I go out there and work with them. I owe them and I owe whoever, you know, this organization to play good. I'm supposed to play good. How frustrating is that you guys, I think yardage wise, it's probably two to one, but the four turnovers and long returns, how frustrating is that on a day when you did some good things but obviously not enough? Yeah, it's frustrating. I mean, like I said, we're a team, you know, we didn't, as a whole, we didn't play good enough to beat, you know, this team today. So we just got to, we got to get better. You try to encourage a special teams guy or you stay out of there? You know, we just, you know, we're all the team. We just got to play better. That's all. We got to play better. Calvin, when you look at the turnovers early in the year, I think people were sort of saying, like, that's a guy trying to do too much. Maybe we can clean that up. When you see four more turnovers now at this point of the year, what's the explanation for that? Um, we just got to play cleaner football. You, know, you got to protect the ball, see it better, and just, just play cleaner football. And, you know, time, you know, we just got to keep working and keep pushing, man. man. That's it. A lot of guys have said they felt like if you can clean up some of the mistakes, you're not that far away. It'll look like, a, you... it'll look like a, t a totally different game. We, you know, we clean the mistakes, man. We're not a bad team, man. We're good. We just put ourselves in a lot of, you know, bad situations, unfortunately. But is it harder to keep that belief that you are good when you see the results of the last two weeks? No, it's football. You know, we, you know, obviously I had a couple bad weeks. You know, we got to. I went to work this week. I changed my whole schedule this week to play better this week for this game. And I'm going to do that in this coming week. So I think, you know, we all need to do that, you know, do a little things probably different than we've been doing. I changed my schedule this week, and it was a little better for me this week. So I'm going to I'm gonna stick by that and keep coming with it. When you say you changed your schedule? I just did things, you know, different for me. I got back to doing, you know, things a little different, and uh, it was uh, – it helped me this week, I think. I mean, it's the same thing every week. Um, we don't play complimentary football. Um, one week it might be the offense. One week it might be the defense. One week it might be special teams. And we haven't yet to um, play complimentary football on all three levels um, of the game. So, yeah. How do you keep the frustration from bubbling over and, and causing things to keep going the wrong way? Got to keep going, keep your head down, keep grinding. Um, you got to understand that, for me, what helps me, you got to understand that the film you put out there is your resume. Um, 31 other teams look at that, um, and you have, to, you, have to play, you have to play your best ball, especially in these times. Because um, in these times, I've been here before, where some players might not get a full energy, might not give it all, um, thinking the season over with, and don't, don't play – don't play, don't play, don't play discipline, football, um, and those, those what you got to do. You got to put good tape out. You guys were putting some tough spots. I mean, they had a lot of short fields, and I'm sure you guys feel like you should stop them. But what, what's the feeling of the defense when you're time and again to get the ball at your 20, starting at your 20-yard line? It's tough because uh, if I'm not mistaken, Detroit offense first half only had – like 130 total yards or something like that, um, and it just it, it's just frustrating because every week it's something. Um, like I said earlier, um, and we just gotta we gotta try to figure it out and fix it.